hello everyone welcome back to another benchmarks video so in this video i will be benchmarking again the forza motorsport 6 apex so forza motorsport is the first game to introduce the dynamic settings feature it's the first of its kind feature which help you to actually to get the desired frames you want if you want the 30 you will get 30 no hustle nothing you have to worry about the adjustment of the settings if you want 60 just keep the setting at 60 you will get 60 so let's me show you how so when you will go into the game you will see the video settings like this so go to the dynamic optimization and keep do it custom after that keep all the settings to dynamic rather than high low medium or high this will help you to get your desired frames so then go to performance target set the 30 if you want 30 if you want 60 so first of all i will show you the 60 fps with low settings it will go up and down but not to much great extent as it's only in beta so you can expect some ups and downs in the frame rate let's quickly start the game I will show you on 30 fps on 60 fps at each and every settings like low high medium and ultra on some settings it will be able to handle your game at 60 but as I am running on GTX N50 Ti so it won't be able to handle on high settings even though you keep it 60 you won't get 60 due to low memory so i kept it on 60 i'm getting 60 on low even on low settings it looks very good shadow is not that up to the mark but then also textures are good it's a gorgeous looking game I must say and it's my very first experience with the Forza series as you can see little bit of stutter and ups and down in the frame rates but it's okay I think that's enough to show on the low settings let's keep it medium and see whether my graphic card will be able to handle or not so it says you must quit the race to get all the effects so we will quit the race and restart the race again this process will have to repeat every time I change the settings Still, still I am getting 60, approximate 55 to 60 as I desired so you will notice no stutter I think as I am experiencing no stutter is pretty very smooth let's change the camera angle let's see as you can see it's almost at 60 on the medium benefit of this dynamic feature is this you don't have to worry about change the settings to so keep your game running at 60 or 30 constant the game will do it for you and you can experience your game better now 
now let's try something high so again we have to quit the game and restart the race again and a pretty good feature which might change the gaming experience in the future so it will get introduced in some future games we hope so there was a freeze in the game you can notice some if you keep on if you go on high settings or ultra settings you will notice some more stutters more freezes as this game is not as this game is pretty heavy for my graphic card but still we can get 60 with maximum performance you can say with best textures the high textures and you can see it's on 60. If you try to change your dynamic settings to custom like high, medium or ultra, you won't get the desired results. I suggest don't do that, keep it dynamic. So let's try the ultra settings. I think if it's running on ultra there is no way of showing there is no need of showing it on 30 fps if it's running ultra on 60 fps but I think I will not get 60 on ultra settings As you can see it shows a notice warning notice low video memory as I am running on ultra my graphic card can't handle the ultra settings so let's ignore it and run the game but it is trying to running run it on 30 fps or below 30 but you will not notice more cutters we will try to reach 60 but it will not low memory but the graphic card with 4 GB can handle easily this game 60 FPS maximum setting I have changed the track as it was night so for the best comparison I changed the track as all other Combinations I did on daytime, daytime. But I am getting approximately the same frame rate, night day, making no difference. I don't think there is a need to show on 30 but I will show on the maximum settings let's quit the race so my game is now 30 locked with the dynamic settings let's see Every time I run it on ultra settings, I will get this notice because it's way too more for 2 GB graphic cards. It is trying constantly to run it on 30 FPS, somewhere higher, but it is not coming below. I 
very heavily. It's on the max setting. I can't go above that. There's only resolution left. 4K. I will quickly show you the settings ultra so quality is ultra dynamic of your custom force resolution you have to keep it so that it doesn't change your resolution performance target is 30 fpi other all things are dynamic to get the best desired result so this is how you can keep it 30 locked constant and you can see dropping